Hey y'all, what is good YouTube? Watch you here with a Arrow Season 6 video. So, we're going to go over who is the vigilante again. Yes, I know I've been over a lot of candidates, but I think my next candidate could possibly be the last candidate. So, as we know, Arrow Season 6 will be about family. And in the season finale of Arrow, Oliver did give something to Slade Wilson that will help him find his son. So what would be the case if the vigilante actually turns out to be Deathstroke's son? Because the theme is family and it would be really telltale if the vigilante did turn out to be, in fact, Slade Wilson's son. It would be freaking awesome. So in Legends of Tomorrow... In an episode called Our, well, Star City 2048, we were introduced to Slade Wilson, who was actually Grant Wilson, who was actually Deathstroke in a future episode where Deathstroke was actually dead and Green Arrow was Old Man Green Arrow and the episode where we had Connor Hawk. And obviously in that scene where they thought they knew him, but they didn't actually know him. And he was like, Slade, that's a name I haven't heard in a long time. How do you know my father? Well, that's a direct quote from Grant Wilson in the Legends of Tomorrow episode. But I think this would be pretty cool if the vigilante actually turned out to be one of Deathstroke's son, sons. Because we know he exists. Uh, previously in Arrow, Deathstroke said his whole family was dead, I'm pretty sure. Don't quote me, but I'm pretty sure... He said that. So it's quite interesting how a vocal part of the finale was the USB stick, I think it was, that Oliver Queen gave to Slade Wilson to find his son. And obviously finding his son is going to be a big part of season six. But what happens if his son is the vigilante? It would make complete sense why the vigilante has a beef with the arrow Green Arrow, because obviously if it is Deathstroke's son, then he would have a gripe with him because obviously his father's been stuck in an Argus prison on Liang Yu for many years, pretty much due to everything that went on. And it was like a foreshadow kind of a knock on effect from what happened in terms of Shadow being killed. Now, I know what you're thinking. This theory is pretty out there. It's pretty ludicrous but that's what we're about on this channel so guys i did a video about vincent who is diana drake's boyfriend who was potentially killed in part called accelerator being the vigilante that could also be true and i also did a video on tommy merlin being vigilante that could also be true because whoever is the vigilante they only need to physically be there when the mask comes off kind of like in episode 100 of arrow when Deathstroke was there, but he wasn't actually there. It wasn't Slade Wilson. It was just someone underneath the mask. So whoever Vigilante is most likely going to be just a stunt double. And Mark Guggenheim did say at Comic-Con 2017 San Diego that it's all going to make sense. And it's someone that we've seen before. And obviously Mark Guggenheim is the executive producer, I'm pretty sure, of Legends of Tomorrow. And Grant Wilson was on Legends Tomorrow. It would be pretty like fitting. I mean, there's also like Joe Wilson, who's uh, who's his half brother. So I'm not saying it would it will definitely be a Grant Wilson, but Grant Wilson is a very strong candidate to actually be the vigilante or vigilante, depends how you pronounce it. So guys, there's no real evidence, but says it's about family it says it all makes sense i mean it really does make sense if the vigilante turns out to be slade wilson's son because obviously he seems to be pretty good in combat through fear around in episode 15 the kind of uh, political gun episode that we had um went toe-to-toe -to -toe with prometheus but kind of got bossed and then disappeared, and we haven't seen him since. I know everyone thinks it's Detective Pike, because Pike disappeared as well, but no, I don't think it's Pike. So guys, comment in, comment down below. Do you think it could be one of Slade Wilson's son? 
i.e. Grant Wilson, is Izzy Vigilante. It would be pretty cool if he was actually the Vigilante. If he isn't, let me know in the comment box down below. Is it Dino Drake's boyfriend, who we thought died during the part called Accelerator? Just let me know in the comment box down below, guys, what you think it is. Any video ideas that you want me to make or any good stuff like that, just drop it in the box down below. Maybe think about subscribing, liking, and commenting, and joining the Team War Stew Warheads Notification Squad, which is just below the subscription button. And I will see you in another video, guys, quite soon. Catch ya later.